I love teaching a kickstand hinge as an introduction to a hinge base movement. Starting off with, let's say our left foot forward, I'm gonna show two scenarios that might happen in your hinge and a couple quick fixes to address them. With that left foot forward, you notice that your right hip is still pretty high as you go to your hinge. One thing that can be helpful is to bring in this left adductor, thinking about almost pulling ourselves down, utilizing a band on the inside to almost pull ourselves around. So I can use a band, a foam roller, something to kind of get this adductor on. So I can even think about kind of pulling myself with the inner thigh and kind of bringing this inlet into a position of more internal rotation so that I can lengthen through the back of the hip. And you feel like you're almost sashaying your left hip out to the side. This might be an indicator that we need some more of this glute to help us maintain that pelvis stability and control. So sometimes when this happens, this knee rolls in. So I like to cue the knee towards the second and third toe while maintaining big toe contact and almost thinking about rooting your pelvis down. So unhiking, staying long and holding this position, you'll feel this outside glute already. And then thinking about that hinge band on the outside, watch that that foot doesn't roll out, but maintaining that glute control as you hinge might give you a better spot to lean.